John 10 1 to 10 is a powerful and evocative passage in which Jesus uses the metaphor of a shepherd and his sheep to illustrate the relationship between himself and his followers. As I reflect on this passage, I am struck by its profound insights into the nature of faith, the character of Jesus, and the relationship between the two. The metaphor of the shepherd and his sheep is a powerful one, with deep roots in both the Jewish and Christian traditions. In this passage, Jesus emphasizes the importance of the shepherd's role in protecting his sheep from harm and leading them to safety. He contrasts the good shepherd with the thief, who comes only to steal, kill, and destroy. This contrast is significant because it reveals something essential about the character of Jesus. He is not simply a teacher or a moral example, he is a protector and a guide. He is someone who is willing to lay down his life for his sheep, and he expects his followers to be willing to do the same. But the metaphor of the shepherd and his sheep also reveals something essential about the nature of faith. Faith is not simply a matter of belief or adherence to a set of rules, it is a relationship, a deep and abiding trust in the one who leads us. Jesus emphasizes this point when he says, my sheep hear my voice and I know them, and they follow me. In other words, faith is not a passive acceptance of doctrine, but an active response to the call of the shepherd. As I reflect on this passage, I am struck by its relevance to our own time. We live in an age of uncertainty and fear, when it is all too easy to be led astray by false prophets and empty promises. But the metaphor of the shepherd, and his sheep, reminds us that there is a better way. It reminds us that, we are called to follow the one who offers us protection, guidance, and ultimately, eternal life. But this passage also challenges us, to examine our own faith, and our own relationship, with Jesus. Do we truly hear his voice and follow him, or are we easily led astray by the voices of this world? Are we willing to lay down our lives, for the sake of the gospel, or do we seek only our own comfort and security? In the end, the message of John 10 1 to 10 is one of hope and reassurance. It reminds us that, we are not alone in this world, but that we have a shepherd, who loves us and is willing to do whatever it takes to keep us safe. May we all strive to hear his voice, and follow him faithfully, trusting in his love, and his guidance, as we journey through this life. Amen.